Concerned to me, peeps, what's up? It's me, John D. Bill, the four-time national champion. That is Paul F. Little joining my phone. Okay, this is it. This is the super game, in my personal opinion. This is like the whole thing right here in the regular season, in my personal opinion, of what's going on. First of all, personal opinion only, not allowed in fact, like I said, it's all for entertainment, parody, purpose only. Please check disclaimers. This is the deal, dude. Jeremy Lin, the biggest sensation in the NBA right now, in my personal opinion, and the New York Knicks are going to face, I believe, their toughest test. They're coming down to Miami, and they're facing LeBron James, in my personal opinion, the best player in the NBA, and the Miami Heat, the best team. You got D. Wade, you got Bosch, you got everybody in the mix. Okay, this is serious. They're on the road. Can they beat the Miami Heat? This is extreme. Everybody wants to know what's going on. It's going down Thursday. Paul, what do you think about this? You're the NBA expert. Tell what's going on. John, being and viewers, I think that Miami is really going to put a big time defeat on Jeremy Lin and the New York Knicks. And the reason I say that is two reasons primarily. First, the Knicks are going to be playing on a back-to-back. -back. They're going to be playing uh, tomorrow. So they're going to go into Miami, fly in, have some tired legs. That's number one. Number two, M Miami, just like uh, Darren Williams and whatever, everybody is hearing Jeremy Lin, Jeremy Lin, Jeremy Lin. Miami is the best team in the league with the best record right now anyway. And they're going to want to make a statement, and they know that TNT, the whole nation, the whole world is going to be watching this game, and they're going to want to change the script from Lynn Stanley to Miami Heat is amazing. And I think they're going to come out and play awesome oh, and this, really get it done. This Heat team, dude, it's 14-1. and one. You're talking a streak. You're talking everything. You're talking a team that was in the finals last year. They have it all going on. This is an elite, elite level situation here. And look, this is going to be a huge, huge test. If Jeremy Lin ever wanted to test his game, this is it right here. We're going to need to see the whole situation. I think that he plays a team sport there. I think he knows what's going on over there. I think the guy's got character, and he's got intelligence, and he's improving every day and every game. At the same time, you're facing, I believe, the toughest test. I agree with you. I think at the end of the day, we we're going to see some good play out of Jeremy Lin. We're going to see these Knicks try to step it up. Melo may step it up. Hopefully the thing gels together. But the bottom line is I see the Heat winning. I think it's too much. I think they've got too much thing going on there. And when you have this explosive offense from the Heat, you see the points they put up tonight against the Sacramento Kings. It might be, it might rattle the cage of the Knicks a little bit. So this is going to be a really interesting game. But I think we're going to see fireworks. I think it's going to be exciting. And if anyone can pull it off, Jeremy Lin and the Knicks can pull it off. We've seen these massive comebacks. But I'm predicting, as you're saying, I'm predicting the Heat and LeBron, in my personal opinion, the best player in the NBA to win this game. What do you fans think? You know we love Jeremy Lin, but we got to call it straight too. And we love LeBron and we love the Heat. So this is going to be an exciting game. How do you see this game breaking down? Who do you think is going to win? Do you think that Jeremy Lin can do it again in Miami? Where do you have it? Give me the comments below. Please subscribe above. I'm John DeVillo, the four-time national champion. That is Paul, the NBA expert. We are Conservative Media. Let us know if you like or dislike this video. We're Conservative Media, and we will see you next time.